Hi everybody and welcome to another video. Today I'm going to show you how to unlock any iPhone from the first generation iPhone all the way to the latest generation. So the first thing that you need to understand is that there are three types of unlocks. The first type is the network unlock. This will unlock your phone to use it with any SIM card in any country from any service provider. Then you have the passcode unlock or the security unlock. This guide will show you how to access your device if maybe you forgot the passcode or the security pattern. And lastly, we have the iCloud activation lock. Maybe you purchased a phone from somebody else and it came with a cloud-based lock. We will discuss ethical solutions, no hacks or anything illegal. So let's begin with the network unlock. Like I said before, this will make your phone compatible with any SIM card. I'll show you the best and the easiest way to remotely unlock your device, meaning that everything is done over the air, no cables and no software required. With that said, let's begin. Step one, we need to get a phone's IMEI number. We will get it by dialing star hash zero six hash. As you will see, the IMEI number will show up in the screen. This is a 15 digit number. This number can also be found in the box and in the settings of your device. In this website, we will request the unlock to unlock this phone. So simply, you have to fill in this form here about your phone's information. It's extremely important to enter the correct IMEI number. That's the number we just got. So enter it here. It should be 15 digit and it must be 100% correct. If there's a mistake here, this method will not work. And the last and final step is to write down your personal email where you're gonna receive the notification. So just write down here your personal email address and they will email you a notification that your phone has been unlocked successfully. All right, you have read everything and you will get a message or an email just like this. I will show you my email account. So this is the email I just got and it says your iPhone has been factory unlocked successfully. So let's go ahead and open this email. So the email will confirm that your iPhone has been successfully unlocked. And now the last step is to connect your iPhone to Wi-Fi to activate the unlock. So that's the way you do a network factory unlock. After receiving the notification that your phone has been unlocked, we're going to power off the device and you will need to remove the SIM card tray and insert a non-supported SIM card. In other words, a SIM card that is different from the original carrier. Power on your device. You will need to connect your device to Wi-Fi and the unlock will be instantly activated. After a few seconds, your device should be successfully unlocked and compatible with any SIM card. Now let's make a test call. And if the call goes through, the process was successful. Perfect. And that's it. Your phone is now unlocked and ready to be used with any network. Now let's move on to the other types of unlocks. Let's proceed with the passcode unlock or the security unlock. This is in case you forgot the passcode of your phone or if your phone has been locked because of too many incorrect attempts. What we will do here is a factory reset to wipe the phone completely and be able to restore it to factory settings to use it again. So please be aware that all the information about this phone will be deleted unless you have a backup of your data somewhere in the cloud or in your computer. The first step is to connect your phone to your computer using a cable. Make sure that your phone has enough battery at least 20%. And then we will enter recovery mode by performing a specific command using the following keys on the side. This may vary depending on every model, so I recommend that you Google how to enter recovery mode in your exact model. For the latest iPhones, this is how you enter recovery mode. Volume up, volume down, and press and hold the power button. And don't let go. If it didn't work on the first time, I suggest that you try it again until you get it. If you did it successfully, we will see the following screen. If you're a Windows user, make sure that you install the latest version of iTunes. I will include a link where you can download it. Your computer should detect your iPhone in recovery mode, and then we're gonna proceed by restoring this phone to factory settings. So this will erase the phone completely. So this will take a while, it depends on your internet connection and the speed of your computer. So let's fast forward and I'll be back once the process is completed. It will take a few seconds and after a while, your device will be restored to factory settings and you should be able to use it without any issues. And there you have it, your phone should be unlocked. Now, in some cases, your phone might be locked to an iCloud account or an activation lock. You will need to contact the previous owner to remove the lock. This would be the best and the cheapest solution. But if you have tried contacting the previous owner and you still have no lock, I will include an article in the description of this video that describes ethical solutions to completely remove the iCloud lock or the activation lock. And that's how you unlock an iPhone. Thank you so much. I hope that this video helped you and we'll see you next time.